Today I'm going to talk about the Sabian symbols. It's a subject that is near and dear to my heart and I just want to bring it out there because they fascinate me. So this is the beginning, bringing the Sabian symbols to you from my perspective. And if you don't know what the Sabian symbols are, they are associated with each, there, there is a picture, pictograph, of every one of the degrees in the zodiac. 12 signs, so there's 30 degrees in each sign. So times 12, that's 360 degrees, 360 pictures of the symbols. And the symbols were intuited by a psychic. Uh, her name was Elsie Wheeler. And Linda Hill talks a lot about her. So forgive me, I know her name and I know that she um, worked with a gentleman. He would pull a card and say, okay, Aries one, and it, the picture would come to her. And so she channeled these. Now, I learned about the Sabian symbols about six years ago, I think, somewhere in that range. And I first uh, learned a lot from Linda Hill and Linda is with a Y. She has a book out called The Sabian Oracle. I bought that and, and that's been the book that I have been making a lot of my notes on. And I also study what Dane Rudyar and John Sambach, and forgive me if I'm not saying that last name correctly. It could be Sandback or San, Sandbach. Hey, all, all of these people have written a lot about the symbols and they just fascinate me. I've been into astrology for about 11, 10 to 11 years at the very least. And as soon as I found out about, you know, that there even were these images for each, each degree, I latched onto it and I've been focused on them for the last six years. Now, most recently, I have been following them, uh, the sun, each day for about the last almost three months now. And when I do, I, um, I always look at the symbol of the day, wherever the sun is. And we're on Libra 6 and Aries 6 right now. So that's where I'm starting. Um, but I always look across the wheel because when you look at both sides, uh, that gives to me, it gives me a better idea of, of the full spectrum of what's being expressed with the symbol. And at any given time, Libra six, you know, yes, right now it's where the sun and the moon, where the sun is, the moon is opposite because it's a full moon. And so it's on Aries six, but depending on what's going on, um, several planets could be together on the same number. So in order for me to get a, a clearer handle on it, I've been following the sun and just paying attention to the two symbols that are represented for that day. And it gives a lot of insight into uh, and then try to tie it together with my emotions and also what's going on like with social media if I see a certain color that's playing out a certain theme that's playing out just to try to get uh, my own full picture of what these are saying you know what 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 is it what's being said to me personally and for me astrology has been a way for me to get at um, the deeper meanings in life and also the deeper meaning of, you know, what, who am I according to my birth chart? And if you only look at what's my sun sign or what's my moon and even just your, the planets, it's, it's just, it's a lot of information to get through in astrology. I mean, it's, it's as deep as the ocean, <laughs> 
the amount of information that is available and it can be overwhelming and that's why I have one of the reasons I have focused on this just to try to to have a point of focus that I can get the most out of and then move on and at the same time I have been seeing if you know on any certain day if uh, an important degree of it's from my birth chart is represented like my third house cusp or uh, a midpoint of my sun and my moon where is my Mars you know stuff like that and for me in my chart Jupiter is really strong and so of course I've been following that as well so knowing about the degrees and focusing on them is a way to get really meaty information about yourself um, because uh, especially for me I think very visually so as an artist I definitely appreciate it because I I just I have a visual sense about me okay so that is what the Sabian symbols are I would love to hear what they are for you um, please leave a comment uh, below if what your experience is with Sabian symbols if you have any questions about them but basically I'm gonna start where we are and that is Libra 6 and Aries 6 and we're just gonna go from there um, this is the intro please subscribe for more as we explore and have an open forum about the symbols of the zodiac Thanks for joining me. Take care.